Okay, day three. Uh, this is a good day. Started great. I woke up with lots of energy. Checked my keto measurements. I'm in deep ketosis. So my PKA is turned off, my stem cells are turning on, and my mu cells are running through the system. My mu's AT, adipose tissue stem cells, are running through the system because I've turned to burning fat for my fuel. I have no more glycogen in the body. It's been burnt out for the last two days, and now I'm running on fat cells. So I've got my uh, triglycerides being cleaved into glycerol and free fatty acids, and they're moving my ketones and plasma glucose. Uh, I was having a headache a little bit last night, but that's normal because the brain works off of sugar. It needs plasma to uh, plasma glucose to work. So that's all gone away. The headaches are gone, and uh, I'm now in day three. So this is a good day because now I can just get some stuff done, you know, walk around, do some things. I'm going to go to the beach tonight and do a turtle walk because the turtles, the uh, loggerhead turtles, are, are hatching out of their, their nests. So I'm going to take a flashlight and Pam and I are going to go down to the turtle walk and see if we can see some little baby turtles about that long run along the beach and get into the, into the water and start their life cycle. Uh, much like my muse cells have started their life cycle. <laughs> anyway, I've got my muse turtles uh, running through my body. Uh, so yeah, it's just a really good day. I have, you can see I have a lot more energy and um, this is how it works. You got to get through those first couple of days. They're really a bother. Boring mostly, a little headachey, a little sleepy. And uh, I did have a nap today, but that's all part of it. When you, you know, everybody's different, you know. Um, other people go through these things. Pam goes through these things. She's up all day and all night. You know, I love to sleep, so I just go to sleep. So it's, it's, you know, your body chemistry, your genetic chemistry is completely different than anybody else. So even though I showed you the thing where I sleep in the bed all day long, not everybody does that. A lot of people just go to drive fast and drive to work every day. You know, it's just, you're a little different. You got to know your body a little bit and you'll know it after the first drive fast because it's kind of the same every drive fast. Um, but yeah, so everything's fine. It's day three and uh, you should be feeling a lot better today. Um, so yeah, make sure to get out and get some walks and get that fresh air, get a little exercise because, you know, doing this walking stuff, it actually pumps the lymphatic system to get toxins that have been taken out of the cells into the lymphatic system and flushed into the bowel so you can get rid of the stuff. So that's all part of it. Not vigorous exercise, although I've heard some people go to the gym and work out. I don't think it's probably necessary or probably a good idea. I think it's more a, uh, a more relaxed scene where you just kind of just walk around, take a walk around the block, take a walk at the beach, take a walk in the woods. And, uh, you know, I took a couple of cold showers yesterday. It felt great. So, you know, the, the soft dry fast is really a better way to go on this stuff because even the Shishenikov and Filinoff talk about it. You know, they say go to lakes, go to streams, soak, the, soak in the water during the dry fast. It has a really beneficial effect psychologically as well as biophysically. So this is the end of day three. It's uh, about four or five in the afternoon, and uh, we'll be going over near sunset to go on the night walk for the turtle walk. And uh, maybe I'll try and shoot a little video over there, but nonetheless, day three. This is really good, and I feel much better. I've got the you know, ketones running like crazy. So uh, hope you're doing the same, hope you're feeling the same, and I will talk to you tomorrow.